Hi, my name is Lily, and today I'm going to be reading to you Stuart Little 2, the movie storybook. I loved this book when I was little, and the movie as well. Let's get into it. I hope you guys love it equally as much as me. Chapter 1, Stuart's New Friend. Stuart Little was part of a loving family. The Littles lived all together in the big city. Stuart lived with his mother, father, brother George, and baby sister Martha. Stuart was the littlest little. Even though Stuart was little, he liked to play the games that the other boys his age played, including soccer. It's going to be great, cheered Stuart before his first game. A big breakfast would help Stuart be ready to play. Of course, most breakfasts were big for Stuart. At the soccer game, Stuart was happy when his coach finally put him on the field to play. Stuart was ready to help his team. But when Stuart ran onto the field, the ball hit him so hard that he got stuck to it and went flying into the goal. Do I get an assist, groaned Stuart? Mrs. Little worried that Stuart would get hurt. He looked so small out there, so lacking in bigness. Does he really have to play soccer, she asked. We have to give him room to grow, said Mr. Little. Do you think he'll grow? <laughs> Mrs. Little thought Stuart had found a nice, safe hobby in building toy models. Stuart and his brother had already built a boat and a car. Now they were building a plane. There's the plane. How do you think it'll go? But something went wrong. I'm in the air, cried Stuart as the plane suddenly took off. Do you think he'll be okay? Stuart flew through, the, through his house and straight out the door. His worried family hurried after him. The plane took Stuart into a nearby park. Mayday, mayday, cried Stuart. Nuns at 12 o'clock. Stuart tried to keep calm. There must be some way to land, he thought to himself. Stuart found a way. He flew, stri he flew straight into a thick bush. Swoosh, smash, crash. Luckily, Stuart was not hurt. There he is. Mr. Little tried to make Stuart feel better. The thing about being a little is that you can always see the bright side. He said, every cloud has a silver li lining. The end. Bye.